Hey, it's the very 29 here. Tonight, I continue with preparations for this year's World Baseball Classic with Pool B, coming from the Tokyo Dome in Japan. The two best teams after this round will be going nowhere. That's because the two will play in the second round in the same stadium, along with the top two teams from Pool A. Participating in this group are qualifier winner Australia, Cuba, China, and the hosts, and as they are called locally, Samurai Japan. Beginning with Australia, who had to play in last year's qualifier in order to get in, did so with little trouble. However, it's time for the Aussies to step up against some of the world's best, and believe it or not, are capable of doing just that. In 2009, they faced Cuba with a trip to the second round on the line, and actually had a 4-2 lead before Cuba came back, and beat them 5-4. A key to that lead was pitcher Travis Blackley, currently pitching for Mexico's Pericos de Puebla. In his 15-year career, he has recorded 1,512 strikeouts and a 112-95 record. Catcher Alan de San Miguel, a four-time Claxton Shield champion with Australia's Perth Heat, signed with the Royals during last year's qualifier. His career consists of 600 hits, 374 RBIs, and a .231 batting average. Pitcher Ryan Searle of the Italian league's Fortitudo Bologna struck out five and made two saves in the qualifier. He has a 58-62 record with a 3.80 ERA and 776 strikeouts. Twins infielder James Beresford is amongst the team's best batters returning for the Classic with 12 hits and three RBIs in his time representing down under. He has in his career a 285 batting average with 1,167 hits and 380 RBIs. Hoping to start a winning streak is China after finishing the 2003 Classic with a come from behind win in its last game. The source of China's success is Ray Chang, who has announced he will officially retire from baseball following this year's Classic. Chang has spent 12 years in the minor leagues for a few teams, most recently with the Reds and was called to spring train last year. In his career, he has had a 270 batting average, 303 RBIs, 720 hits, and 26 home runs. Leading the pitching rotation is former big leaguer and classic veteran Bruce Chen, who originally played for his native Panama. However, since Panama lost their qualifier, and Chen is also of Chinese descent, he is eligible to play and has committed. In his career, he has thrown 1,140 strikeouts and has an 82-81 record. Gi Yuangshu signed with the Orioles organization last year and played in the Gulf Coast League. There, in 33 games, he recorded a 247 batting average consisting of 20 hits, 9 RBIs, and scored 11 runs. Looking for a return to the championship after coming up short in the inaugural tournament is mighty Cuba. This team has always suffered from defections, but Cuba really suffered big since the last Classic with notable stars such as Jose Abreu and Yulieski Goriel leaving for the majors. But as always, Cuba has the talent to fill up the roster and give global exposure to. One player who will make his fourth WBC appearance is Sancti Spiritus' Frederick Cepeda, who has recorded in the Classic 31 hits, 18 RBIs, 17 runs, and a record 6 home runs. Another star player returning is Alfredo de Spain of Japan's Chibalote Marines. He has recorded in the Classic 3 home runs, 11 hits, 10 RBIs, and scored 17 runs. Alazanes de Grama star Carlos Benitez could add hitting power with his 81 home runs and 372 RBIs. He also led his team in batting in this year's Caribbean series with an overall 438 batting average. Last up in his pool is two-time champion Samurai Japan whose roster consists almost entirely of the Palm Professional Baseball Stars. The only non-NPB player on the roster is Astros outfielder Norichika Aoki, who has a 286 batting average stemming from 681 hits and has 184 RBIs. In the three classics he's been in, he has had 13 hits and 8 RBIs and was elected to the 2009 All-WBC team. Hokkaido Nippon Hamfighters outfielder Sho Nakata is a two-time Pacific League Best 9 Award winner. He has in his career a 257 batting average, 415 runs, 866 hits, and 161 home runs. 
Seiji Uchikawa of the Fukuoka SoftBank Hawks is a five-time All-Star and two-time batting champion. He brings a 284 batting average with 1,896 hits and 164 home runs to Tokyo. His experience in the Classic consists of 14 hits and 8 RBIs. Yoimuri Giants shortstop Hayato Sakamoto is a six-time All-Star and two-time Japan Series champion with 1,402 hits, 150 home runs, 578 RBIs, and a 286 batting average. This group looks to be another easy pick for Cuba and Japan. However, I'm actually interested in seeing the China-Australia game. A win for China would be the first against a team with Major League talent and would prevent them from finishing last place for the third time in a row. This is it for Pool B. Hope you enjoyed this preview and hope that this will draw interest in seeing what happens in Tokyo. Once again, be sure to tune in and support your team. Represent! Dai Biao! Representar! Dai Resuru! This is Isla Verde 29 and I'm out of here.